and welcome back to the series of subdivisions inside of Pelican Bay located right here in beautiful Daytona Beach. In case you missed some of the other videos, I'm going ahead and doing a video on each of the subdivisions inside Pelican Bay, which if you have been following along, you probably noticed is quite a large subdivision, but well maintained. If you've seen any of these videos, you probably notice how beautiful and gorgeous these subdivisions are at yet is still very affordable price. Today, I'm going to drive through Mallard Cove and Islandia, which is a little closer to the West Gate. I'm going to cover these two subdivisions as they are a little bit smaller and I figured it would make one nice video. So come on, let's go take a look around. As we enter Mallard Cove, you will notice right off the bat, it's surrounded by several canals. Of course, the golf course is throughout all of Pelican Bay, which includes Mallard Cove. Nice, peaceful, well-kept subdivision. And as you'll see as we drive around, these are single family homes, primarily three bedroom, two bath with a two car garage. Family friendly area, nice place to ride or walk around. Just absolutely lovely inside of Mallard Cove. You will still see a lot of yard debris laying around. This is due to Hurricane Ian and then Tropical Storm Nicole that came through. It just took the city many, many weeks to clean this all up. They did clean it up. It ended up looking amazing. Big thanks to the city of Daytona Beach. Right after we go over this cute little bridge here, we're basically entering now Islandia, which is another great community right next to Mallard Cove, located close to the West Gates, inside of beautiful Pelican Bay. And just like Mallard Cove, it is a well-kept area. Single family homes, primarily three bedroom, two bath, with two car garages. Great area to walk, bike, and for those of you Pelican Bay residents that enjoy fishing, you can go ahead and do some catch and release fishing in our beautiful canals. Well, what did you think of either one of those subdivisions, Mallard Cove or Islandia? Like I said, both located closer to the West Gate, which is just a hair closer to 95 and I-4. If you'd like more information on these homes or any homes in Pelican Bay or the greater Daytona Beach area, go ahead, give me a call, send me a text, or shoot me an email. Just know I got your back. We'll move into beautiful Daytona Beach, Florida. Until next time.